part one of this series, we took you from signing up for Amazon S3 through uploading your first file and determining the URL or web address of that file. To accomplish those tasks, we used an add-on for the Firefox browser known as the Amazon S3 Firefox Organizer. While the Firefox Organizer is a great tool and it's free, it's missing one feature that might be important to many of you. When you upload a video using the Firefox S3 Organizer, you can determine the URL of each file by right-clicking on the file and choosing Copy URL to Clipboard. But that is a uh, wide open URL. If you use that in your web page, your email, to allow other people to watch the video, uh, anyone can also take that URL and embed the video into their web page. In this video, we'll look at two possible solutions to that problem one paid and one free. If you go to bucketexplorer.com, you'll find several helpful tools for dealing with the Amazon S3 services. Uh, Bucket Explorer itself allows you to create URLs that are time limited. They will expire after a certain time and no longer reach the video on your Amazon S3 account. Now let's look at the Bucket Explorer application itself. While the Firefox S3 Organizer works with a browser, Bucket Explorer is a standalone application that does not need a browser. It does need an internet connection, of course. And it's uh, very similar to the Firefox Organizer, except that where Firefox uses two main windows, Bucket Explorer uses three. The window on the left uh, lists all the files on your hard drive. The large window on the right lists all your buckets or file folders. And when you double click on one of those buckets, the large window at the bottom lists all the files within that bucket or folder. Now, as we said, the main thing we want to do with Bucket Explorer is to generate a URL for a file that is time limited that will expire after a certain amount of time. This would come in handy, say, for someone who had a membership website containing videos and uh, he wanted to make a video available to his members for a limited amount of time and not have to worry about that URL being distributed around the internet and used by other people without uh, paying their membership fees. Uh, the way you do that is very simple. You just right click on the file name, choose generate web URL, and you get a dialog box that allows you to create several different types of URLs. To create a time limited URL, you would want to use the signed URL button. And here you have the expiration date and time. You have a handy calendar here. You can change it to the any day and time you wish. And here you see the time limited URL ready to be copied to your clipboard and used uh, in your web pages or emails. In addition to making it easy to create a time stamped URL for your files, Bucket Explorer also makes it easy to copy, paste, and relocate your files from one bucket to another, as well as deleting those files. For all those operations, you simply right click on the name of the file. You see here you have a delete file choice and if you move down the list you also have copy, move, and rename making it very easy to manage your files with Bucket Explorer. For a free approach to protecting your videos that you have stored on Amazon S3 go to Bill Myers Online at this web address and Bill has provided a tool that will create a URL that only allows your video to be played from a specific website. 
As you see here, it's very simple to use. In this field, you would enter your S3 URL. Uh, tell the width and the height of your video. And then enter the domain of the website where you want the video to be able to play. And once you use this script, the video will not play from other domains or other websites. If someone tries to play your video from a domain other than the one you just entered and restrict to domain, they will be redirected to whatever URL you specify here. You could, for example, create a page informing the people trying to play your video that they need to go to your main website up here. Once you have all those filled in, just click on Create Protection Script. The same page on Bill Myers Online also includes complete instructions for his protection script along with video tutorials.